Hi everybody and welcome to the pit. We're in the middle of the XRT pit with Passion Pit. How are you guys doing? The reason I was standing is because I have the Bob Marker or Bob Barker uh, <laughs> microphone, but I'm calling myself Bob Marker. <laughs> That's my, my new character. Thanks, hey Bob. everybody, yeah, it's great to see you. Now, uh, why don't you introduce yourselves? Uh, I'm Ian, I play guitar and keys. I'm Michael, I sing and play keys. I'm Jeff, I play bass. I'm Nate and I play drums. And it is Passion Pit. Now, last time we saw you guys, uh, we were at Bonnaroo. Yeah. We did some hanging. We, uh, we, we seem to keep running into each other. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the one thing we're missing here at Lollapalooza is the bus we had at Bonnaroo with the, uh, with, the, with, the, with the driver who cooked our food. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It was really cool. And that, that Shane. Mixed uh, sangria, like, lemonade thing. Do you know what I'm talking about? Does no. anyone else no. have that? <laughs> no idea. I was expecting you burgers. had it. What? It's like a it was like a jug of like mixed liquor. That oh was yeah, really yeah, strong. yeah, yeah. I no remember now. Lying. No, we're talking. <laughs> you're talking about something else. But I know you're talking about the spin tent. Oh, you're right. You're talking about the spin no. We had tent. food. We're talking about we had bus. food that kept you going, that kept you moving, that kept you up all night. Delicious. We yeah. had chicken and, and we I, had yeah, all sorts noodles. of really great dishes. I yeah. remember you guys were like, "You want food?" And I thought I was gonna get a burger, and I got like fettuccine with like sautéed <laughs> vegetables and chicken off a grill. But here you now, now. Here you are at Lollapalooza. Now you guys had a late night last night. You played uh, at the Hard Rock Hotel. Yep. How did that go? Um, it was good. It was very crowded and hot and kind of messy just because of all these people in the kind of a confined area but it was good it was a really good crowd i was kind of expecting the room to clear after jizza and sandy gold played but it was like we went out like one and it was still completely packed so yeah well you guys certainly are uh have a lively stage presence when nice. we the, the one time i did see you was at bonnaroo on that first night and that was uh playing in that big tent and there was probably fifteen thousand people there or so and uh they all seem to be really familiar with your music. Everybody was really into it. That's pretty amazing, you know, with the record just coming out at that point. I don't even think it had been released. And every, everyone was, uh, seemed to, to, to know what you guys did and enjoyed it. That, um, it's incredible the way the music business is these days with music just getting out there so early. Yeah. But your EP did come out um, a bit earlier than the album, the, uh, the EP. And uh, yeah, so people knew the music. Now, you're from Chicago. Yep. Yeah, I am. So it's kind of a uh, kind of a uh, coming home for you. It, yeah, it's weird coming back here because I've lived in Boston for about five years, yeah. and I feel like Chicago is really growing. Like there's this weird glass building kind of by the Hancock area, and I have no idea what it is. It just feel like it came out of nowhere. The big tall one. Yeah. And they changed the name. And of they the changed the name of the Sears, Sears Tower to Willis Tower. South Tax is Willis up. Tower, yeah. What's going on over here? <laughs> uh, yeah, you blink your eyes and it, and it all changes. Yeah. You know, you're driving in your car and you come to an intersection. And you're like. Where did yeah. this come from? <laughs> this is this new store? Yeah. yeah. Well, we certainly enjoy playing the uh, the Manners record, the new album, on the air. And you know, the thing about your record is there's so many songs to choose from. Uh, it, it's it's difficult to come up with uh, with a song. I mean, you, we could play the entire album, and and every song is just like one right after another. It's uh it's so much fun to listen to. It must be a lot of fun to play. Yeah, it is. It came together over the course of a few weeks, obviously, because. We came out of the studio and we had to start rehearsing all the songs because they're written in the studio and then really just touring on the materials what kind of fleshed it out. Yeah. And I think now we're kind of comfortable with the arrangements and we're just starting to get into that kind of muscle memory, yeah. that touring groove thing where you just all the songs just work every show. We're almost there, but it takes a, it takes a little while. So yeah, they are fun though. Yeah. Very fun. Now, I, uh, I saw you guys recently on television. It was your first uh, TV appearance on the Jimmy Fallon show. Yeah. 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 How did that go for you guys? It was it was really fun. I I was doing really good until right when we were on set and I w looked over and saw Jimmy Fallon like holding the record and like about to announce us. Like everything got very lucid for me and I was like, "Oh my god, we're about to be on TV." And it it happened so fast, but it was really enjoyable and it was yeah. really fun. It's kind of a funny setup the way they have the uh, the people on stage. Right. Yeah. The bandstand. Yeah, on the ba on the sides and in the back. It's Not it's funny because one of our good friends who we, we've done two tours with somehow won ticket to be <laughs> there. So the, the, the shirt I was wearing during that set yeah. was his shirt, like his band's shirt, and he's like standing right next to me to the <laughs> left. It's it 
pretty funny. It's really surreal. Yeah. Now those people who are on the on the stage like that, are they in the audience or are they just come in for that one song? Yeah, they're they're in the audience. I yeah, think. they just get loaded in there. And then like they I, enter a contest, like VIP yeah. tickets, and they bring them in to go around the yeah. stage. It's kind of funny. It's like uh, a little mini festival. Yeah. So it's one song festival. Yeah. <laughs> That's how you do it. But you guys are playing this afternoon. You're you're playing on a stage. Uh, that I was just over by the uh, it's it's the uh, the city stage yeah and it's on a, it's on the street yeah and it's kind of a compact area because it's the street and it's it's going to be like a club and I'm sure it's going to be jam packed when you're playing it's going to be a lot yeah. of fun I yeah I hope so yeah, yeah and it's under trees too yeah, so even shade, though you guys yeah. are wearing the black jeans it may be uh, maybe okay for you yeah <laughs> I saw a hot chip on that stage actually like four years ago yeah. That's where I first saw them. So. Now you are coming back to Chicago in the fall. Yeah, uh, it's uh, it's a show that hasn't been announced yet, so I can't really say too much about it. But it's going to be really exciting, and uh, it's going to create uh, a major buzz for your show when it when it happens uh, this fall. We'll say <laughs> because you know it's uh, it's strategic. I did it's, not know about that. It's <laughs> well, see, <laughs> you will be finding out about it. That's uh, how secret it is. That's we don't how even secret, know. Yeah. So uh, when you do come back, we look forward to seeing you and have a great show this afternoon Thank you. and uh, Thank stay nice. cool, get something cool to drink and uh, yeah. welcome back to welcome back home. Are you, is your family Thank here? You. Yeah, they'll be here today. Oh, cool. Yeah. That's great. So, all right. Enjoy yourselves. Thanks a lot for stopping by. Thank you. Thanks. Thank Passion you. Pit live backstage here at Lollapalooza. I'm Marty Leonard. It's at 93XRT.com.